Good morning, good morning. Mind you, let me answer it. Honestly, this I don't need this not have nothing to do with loving one person at one time or two different persons at one time. I could give you a rata. No English, no proper thing. Enough time I fuck a boy and if I couldn't take back my fuck and my memories, me erase it. Me erase it. Because I ask myself when me did sip on it in the first instance. But me never see it when me just start. And me, yo, if me couldn't go back time, so mm, race it, mm, race it, take it like a rubber, but don't worry about it. And this have nothing to do with two or three persons at the time. At the moment in time while I was with that person, if I couldn't take, yo, enough time, but don't just go back to a boy and say, give me back all of my fuck them, all of my fuck them. <laughs> Yeah, man, in a situation like that, you never know where you go book up in until when time you're dead, you see it. Because sometimes, where you see, actually, you know where you get. You see me? Uh, only part time I find myself in a them situation, the man. But sometimes you have to make the most of a bad situation because, in a certain case, you don't spend all your money already. You see me? Yeah. Because you don't know the thing set, you know, you give you get, so you don't spend your money or anything or something like that, so. But when you fire, you make it best or bad situation. Mm, but, that no stop nothing. So you do it over again, see, you and just hope for the best, you know, because you never can tell, you know, when you, when you get in one of them situations, like, how the outcome will be. You see me? Because think about it. Then you don't feel the same way about you, just so you feel about them, or them just not feel no flipping away, see where they don't know something they might look and I eat that. You see me, so they now nah, give them best, and you want to say, you know, it's not even worth it. You see me. That's how you go, man. Mm. I want to be the first person to respond to this. Somebody else can respond and make me respond second. But my answer to this is yes. Uh, was it worth it? Yes. I have no regrets. <laughs> um, to the class discussion, yes. And it was definitely worth it. <laughs> I remember one female lady come across and I met her say, Jaja, if you would have go back in a time and just, you know, take back everything on her. Yeah, so, I know this girl from another community. She not, she's not from country, she's from Trelawney, but she has family back in So she come here, but at the time, me see she had caused a deal, but I never know if they was intimate like that. So I so, look past that, because as I said, I never see them yet, as in like, when I hear them leave but I never really hear them. So boom, I go and party at Trelawney now and buck up at the same girl down there, exchange number and then, she ended up like a Kingston to her family and the men are end up a par and God a D me and this are the worst me some regret having sex with that female. I swear from my life, me some regret it man, me and this are the worst me that I make in my life. You know say I she had the first female me ever box. Cause she this she, she deserved the box me and tell you. Boom. Then they do the thing and I do the thing and about some months past and thing. You know, when you lie down, you're not a female attack. I'm not a work with normal conversation. So I said, I said, I said, I want staff party to come up. I said, I said, I asked her if she want to come on. I don't remember her response, but I know she never went on forward. So I didn't go back past that. I mean, I want to come in here because she has to do me now. Energy now, I'm fit right. So I'm sorry, I'm not going to press it. Boom, ready then, I got a staff party and. I come out through the gate and by the time I come out, she come in at the yard. Jake me up a long time, boy, I go. So I say, me think that joke. Gun finger and a piece, and my face, I push up my face and up. And I go on the moves, and I say, woman girl, I can't do that, man. I want to be actually embarrassed when I put a white me in and I crush up my shirt, man. What kind of thing that you are doing? They're not going to rule, rule. I say, wait, I want to go. So, I said, no, man, this train, man. He said, I'm going to lift the hand, man, and drop it from on a jerk and, and drop it on Egypt. Say, she leg off from me so fast. Yeah? From that, 
Me just hear us eat all that. Me not eat all that, but me just like see her because she just she just vulgar. Me see all of them something, me just still give me the no but yeah man, that was my regret. I don't even know if it makes sense, but that was my regret. Well, yes, I have had sex with more than one woman, one woman. Excuse my grammar. Yeah, and I live to regret it more than once. Even my kid's mother. I ah, sometimes you meet some woman you say and it's all good and dandy and things going so smooth and just an example of what happened to me. Especially with my I'm not gonna you well, maybe I can chip in my son mother. But the worst woman I've ever talked to and regret it to the greatest and extreme right now is my daughter mother. She is the worst thing we ever come across in my life. Now, like, the sex was good. You know what I mean? But for no say, you've been with a woman where she never did well in school and she said she want back a second chance and you send her back to school. She's sick and you send her to hospital. You do operation, remove lump out her chest and spend over half a million dollars for fix her up a normal period cramping and bleeding and all of them thing there just an example me give you know, you know and my fix her up and everything right and then while she going to school you know my son used to say to me so when him come from school real school greater put more cash used to go classes he said boy i'm uh, meet him stepmother up at the school and when her class over him walk with her over and more than one occasion him go there and she's not there you see me and her excuse is she got kfc or me they don't get the shout say yo me just a cut long story short quite long see me don't get stories say yo man pick her up in a vehicle and carry her gone and one bag of foolishness anyway you know it go on and go on till eventually you know, she get pregnant for me. Me know why I say my baby she get pregnant with. You see me? And she have my daughter. And thing. And right, uh, you guys probably hear the story already. I mean, same one. See? You know, right after she have my daughter about hour, oh, not even two months good, she still a cheat. Gone at the man here yeah, with the baby and her breast. While she breastfeed, she has sex with the man, same way. And one bag of when I find out about it, I can't take it no more. What she do? She pack up her stuff them when I never did it and disappear with my picnic. And I do not lie. You know, I not a youth, I lick woman. I never used to lick her or anything like that. I used to cuss about it because I never, you know. People call me Carlton and all them fools. She said, no, I don't really say Carlton. It's just that I'm not a woman beater and I believe in giving people second chances, which I give her more than two chances. You see me I say, and boom bang bang, she, <laughs> she, she go with my daughter. I ask my view for assist me in finding them, and put out the ad, I find them. And when I find her now and go court now, we can more access to my daughter because she keep, I don't do this girl one thing. The world can ask when I do this girl yeah. And the world, the people where know me and I can't tell her this girl, nothing but good. You see me? <clears throat> and she think that when she, when we took out the summons to carry her coach, she disappear again. That are the worst woman if I could have taken back the fuck them and never breed her. I'm not lying at the end of the day. It's my daughter. It's her life. I love my daughter. But she not deserve to born in a situation like this. I'd rather she be born Right for a different man. Our born for the man where the mother there with now. That no say yo. She cheat upon me. She have my child. And she dare on the next man with my child. And disappear. And don't want to do the right thing by giving me access to my child. Because of foolishness. You get what I say? Yeah. So if me could have taken back all of them. Fuck them. When me fuck her. Because doctor tell her say, it was impossible for her to get pregnant. And by some miracle. This girl get pregnant. No joke. That's a miracle child. Baby. And she experienced that. And do what she do. I mean now like. Yeah it's a miracle child. I'm a believing I'm a God. I don't know why God put me in this position. But may I tell you the truth. If I could have taken back all of them fuck there. And go back in time. And get rid of her out of my life. Just now deal with her. How I get to meet her and thing. 
me do it. Yeah. She had the worst thing for ever walk across my, my side. Yeah, and my son, mother, me get all married to she. I may end up divorced her because she that cheat and I do the same thing. When I was up, I take care of her for 10 years, get all married to her. And I went me lose my job because man thief my identity and my be. And thief care and all sort of sitting. You see me? And after after a couple of years, the case choked because they finally catch the right guy. During that time while going to court, she that cheat and all sort of sitting. To lead to argument, I find out it lead to argument. I see video on her phone with she and the man of sex. The, the, the man would all five times bigger than my one. She could even manage it. See it on her phone. Yeah? Till it lead to all divorce, right? You know? If I could have taken back all of them, fuck them, take back the marriage and take back everything. I regret it. Them two girls are the worst thing to ever come across my life. The thing is, I love my son. I graduate from school and I get all them subject them and thing. I'm happy for that. You see me? That's my ex-wife's son. You see me? But I don't like me. I know I never sex her or anything. I would have, you know, born and rape. But trust me. In the back of my head, I could have just take back them fuck me. I swear I'll take it back. Afternoon. You know, I've never been in that situation because I only get myself involved with persons who I'm in a relationship with. So it's not like, say, um, I'm going to talk to somebody. Partner, no, it's only who I'm in a relationship with. Yeah, man, in a situation like that, you never know where you go book up in until when time you're dead, you see it. Uh, Sometimes, where you see, actually, I know where you get. You see me? Uh, only part time I find myself in a them situation, the man. But sometimes you have to make the most of a bad situation because in a certain case you don't spend all your money already, you see me? Yeah. Because you don't know the thing set, you know? You give you get so you don't spend your money already or something like that. So, but when you find you make the best of a bad situation. Mm, but that no stop nothing. Yeah, do it over again, see me, and just hope for the best you know, Cause you never can tell you know when you, when you get in one of them situations like, how the outcome will be. You see me? Cause think about it. Then you don't feel the same way about you just so you feel about them or them just no feel no flipping away see where they don't know say something them look and I eat that. You see me, so they now nah, give them best and you want to say you know. It's not even worth it. You see me? So you go, man. Mm. I mean, in a them situation, they have to deal with the consequences that comes with it now. Because at the end of the day, nobody now go talk about, say, them stuff, body now. Everybody talk about them things on a high, high level and high regards. You see me? No man now go talk down on them things, and no woman now go talk down on her things. At the end of the day, if you choose to go over there, you have to deal with the consequences that come with it. You see me? Seeing if you go over there, knowing that you're in a relationship, you know, nine out of ten times, anything when I dark, I go surface and come a light. And when it come a light, you have to deal with the consequences that the ramification that comes with it where you go to lick your relationship because then your woman I go say, but wait. You go do what? You see it, so as me say, you have to deal with the consequences that comes with it, you know. Yes, regrets I go there because you go to go over there. And I live up to the billing as how the whole heap attack did I go on. And then when you go over there now and finally get where you forget. And you see say I live up to the billings now. Yeah, I said, John, no, waste my waste my time. You see me? You see it? You know? Because at the end of the day, everybody want what they want. You see it? You know? And everybody after everybody. You have some people where they just. Now go connect with, now go work. Now keep how you try, just now work. You see me? So you have to look upon it and understand say, boy, what you have. You know? Is it worth it? Or is it not worth it? Is it worth it for me to go over there and go, try something? Or I go keep what I have, because I know what I have worth it. Yeah, man, that's something you look upon it, brother, but you have to deal with the consequences that come with it at all times. Well, in my view, what kind of setup this man? 
But I drove from a little Tuesday night, you know, so I went live a, um, I live a watch me, so full around girl from Islington. And I go to Islington one day to check her one weekend, and yes, so she got a key man. And her cousin texted for me, and yeah, me and her cousin go start hanging out, and things happen. Big man thing, things happen. Then me and the cousin start, you know, doing things. And my car, the cousin from East Linton up at St. Mary, come link me at Ochi. I'm going to book in our hotel in Jamaica Grand at the time. I think it's in Renaissance now. Virgin, go over there, so with the girl. Many girls have a time of her life on whole entire weekend. Have a weekend, spend a weekend there. Me and the thing I move nice, everything I move good. And one of me went no, me kind of drift with her she, because the cousin went tell me all kind of bad things about her. I say, you know what? Uh, I know for me this up. Uh. And then, uh, you know, we used to say that, uh, with him say America now, you're young, dumb, and full of cum, something like that. What me know offend nobody. We went basically fall feet. And the cousin went kind of have me half time me out and make me wait. And then I book her cousin. Her cousin just fling it up for me right away. And things are not all good. And when the two of them realized, I told them and they had me out, Bridget. When I told them and they had me out, I said, Well, I go and I line up on my bridge if you deal with the other cousin, the one when I went time me out. And I said, Okay. Realized, Bridget, one almost tapped me up and one try to hassle me. And I left it to them alone. I regret it. One of them sent me a friend request on Facebook and I denied it to them. Blocked them too.